All right, officially hammer time. Uh, just checked in. They're giving me a little trouble because this thing looked too good. But uh, no, we're gonna go start playing around, pre-running a little. Uh, then we gotta run to PCI, get some radios tunes, but uh, go run a little and kind of see how the mud is treating this course um, and just kind of get the layout of what the, you know, hammer town is before we start hitting it hard with my boy, Mike Kim, so. So did it? Just touch this frame. Oh, they will bypass that next lap. My pretty girl. This is the dream office. As a kid, well, as an adult too, this is what I've like dreamed and dreamed of. As a luxury free runner. I know people hate on them, but there's something about it. It's pretty sick. pre-running Baja. I mean, we destroy t-shirts, we destroy pants just because like you're out in the environments and it just destroys stuff. Now, I can wear my freaking Lululemon uh, gym shorts in here. There's that too. But now I feel like an asshole. If I saw, that's the problem, I'm gonna, if I. <laughs> so you hated pretty hard. <laughs> yeah, I've hated. I'm gonna see someone get out, I'm gonna see myself get out of my pre-runner and be like, damn, that guy's an asshole. I'm not gonna say any names, but I'd see some other people get out of their luxury pre runners and gym shorts and a t shirt. And meanwhile, it's downpouring and I wanna jump off a cliff because I'm freezing to death in my razor. And I'm like, man, that guy sucks. But now I'm gonna be that guy, so. You don't hate on everyone, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. that you sat yesterday so we're well we're in helmets today apparently you can't drive the raptor without a helmet no it's probably safer anyway so. it's a little 
louder though. Yeah, it's much nicer than the old Razor. We're doing 80 right now, and it's just. It's cheap compared to the Razor, man. Corner, left corner. Ben's calling notes a little late. No, I know that. I think we're first one on the horse this morning, bro. It's just a little bit there. That is a wrap on uh, day one of pre-running. King of the Hammers, dude. Luxury pre-runner is rad, not gonna lie. It is, the weather has been, you know, it's cold out here, King of the Hammers, and it's been sick. Uh, yeah, this thing's fun though. But uh, we just cruise kinda, so, you know, just like easy, getting Mike Kim, you know, getting some notes, and yeah, tomorrow we'll hit it hard. Tomorrow's our second and final day of pre-running, which is never, uh, <laughs> Fun. You know, Christopher likes to spend like 12, 12 days pre-running. Normally I can memorize everything, but this is only an 87 mile lap or something. So it's uh, pretty quick to memorize because normally I'm memorizing like 550 miles. So yeah, but that is a wrap. And yeah, now the chaos begins. As you can see, everyone's moving into the optimal oasis, which is the place to be. But right now it's, you know, they're still figuring it out, but Freaking, I'm hyped. This King of Hammers is gonna be sick. Um, yeah, I'm just excited. Like I roll through town and I'm just like smiling, like last year, and like you know, it's just, it's all, it's all coming together, real nice. But yeah, see you at the next one. <laughs> I guess it's not the next one. We're, just, we're just probably one vlog or this two vlog. I don't know. Whenever I see you next. <laughs> God damn it, Ben's is not answering, bro. I'm just sitting here. Summertime.